continue the story for Battlefield 1. For sure it's going to be amazing playing this next chapter. I'm expecting a lot from this one from the looks of it. It looks like we're going to be flying a plane. So the next chapter we're going to be playing guys is called Friends in High Places. The first one through mud and blood was uh, pretty good. It's pretty decent. Not bad. I want to know what the hell happened to them afterwards, you know. Um, you guys haven't seen the episode. There is a playlist called Battlefield 1 War Stories. You guys might want to check it on my channel. So you guys can kind of keep up with the story. So now we're going to be starting off Friends Before in High I got Places. To Europe, I'd never seen an aeroplane in real life. High above they twisted and turned like flocks of birds dancing. There was a romance surrounding pilots. These new swashbucklers of the skies. But the reality was... Alright, cool story, man. Let's start the chapter already before this video turns around like 30 minutes. Because I want every video to be like 20 minutes long. So I'm going to try to kind of like uh, speed run it as fast as I can so it won't be so long. I know people don't have like very long uh, viewing retention or whatever. Uh, atten attention span. That's pretty much what it is. So I'll try to speed it up as fast as I can. I will not try to take my time. It's... You know, so you guys can like watch the whole story and shit. So let's see what happens in this one. A steady flow of new aircraft designs are launched into the skies of War Torn. Uh, I totally misread that. <laughs> new innovations are a gamble. Aviators risk their lives with their unproven technologies. Those that beat the odds either adapt quickly or are lucky. You know, that's another true thing. Not a lot of people know how to fly planes during that time. When were planes invented? <laughs> God damn, man. Like, I knew the dates back in the day, but now that I haven't even studied about all this, you know, I'm pretty sure it already went off my mind. I have so. nothing left to bet, you idiot. The plane. <laughs> <laughs> That's rich. Uh -huh. Oh, why the hell not? I've got you beaten anyway. Uh, yeah. What have you got? Hmm? To... <laughs> oh my god, the quads. Wipe your mouth, Blackburn. That wasn't supposed to happen. But you know, Can't believe he had quad aces. Anyway. What the... Bloody hell! You lost, I beat you! Mm. The thing is, Rackham, it's a very beautiful aeroplane and... You're kind of a jackass. I beat you fair and square, goddammit! Stay the hell away! From my <laughs> oh, you bastard! You can't do this to me! I beat you! <laughs> oh my god. I beat you! The my question is, how did he time friend. to the chair, though? I'm a pilot. And a gambler. I'm George Rackham! I'm George Bloody Rackham! Listen to me! You bastard! Keep off my aeroplane! If you asked me to name my biggest fault, I'd have to tell you. I'm just <laughs> not a very honest person. That was crazy. Hey, this chapter's starting to look pretty good. Welcome aboard! I'm Wilson, by the way. You must be George Rackham. Sure, I'm Rackham. I'm your guy. <laughs> what a liar. Blood. Let's get this kite up in the air. You're George Rackham, son of the 4th Earl of Windsor. That's right. All right, what side are we playing on? The are we playing Bristol on the British side or on the U.S. side? That's pure joy kind of a, have been my question like for the longest sunny day time. And everything to would be honest, been perfect had I only been alone. Hey, oh, back there! Flight. It's a great day for a picnic, don't you think? Right, you see that plane up ahead? You need to catch up with it. Yeah, yeah. Approach the fighter to begin so test. Listen, I know this little French place. Maybe we pick up a couple of girls. What are you talking about? Girls? This is a test flight. You need to follow the route that plane is setting for you. Okay, you're the boss, apparently. I'm trying to catch up to this thing. Now let's get a feel for the young. Stay close on his tail. Oh my god! I almost crashed the damn plane on the mountain! No, 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 no! I'm trying to see where it is. There it is. There it is. Actually, this controls faster than the planes I ride in a multiplayer. Why is that? 
Maybe because I don't use enough fighter jets, I usually use motors. This isn't too much flame for you, is it? Get closer. I'm trying, but the asshole is doing all these stunts. I can't even catch up. All right, keep this distance. Fuck no, you said you wanted to go straight, straight up next to it, so that's what I'm gonna do. Hang on, Wingnut. Tell him to stop doing that. <laughs> He's moving way too much. Look at that. Like a literally a skid. Let's see how she handles in a gunfight. Guns are on safe, just in case you get some fancy ideas. You're starting to get me. How sweet. I guess this is just a tutorial for like how to fly a plane. Oh my god, man. Where'd he go? Look at this the asshole, man. Like I can't plane. really catch Best up to him. Means you can make tighter turns. I just did like two flips out of nowhere. And now we're flying upside down. Turn over, god damn it. You know why it's so simple for me like to fly a plane here in Battlefield 1 compared to like Battlefield 4? Because in Battlefield 4 I never used the jets. I couldn't fly that son of a bitch. But the reason why I know how to fly this one is because the uh, GTA 5 had the similar controls so now I know how to fly the planes pretty easily. But in Battlefield 4 it's kind of complicated. Even the choppers. I don't even know how to fly the choppers in that freaking game. I suck at that. So. That's another question. How come there's no choppers in this game? I'm pretty sure there were choppers at some point. So, um, now that I know how to fly a plane, I think we should move on to the next thing, don't you think? Guy in the back. Don't let him get away! Let's see what else he's got. Just stay with him! Can I start shooting things, please? God. If I have to, like, put like went to like forward this video I will my description I just will because this is nothing we did nothing for 10 minutes I think that this is like probably my longest tutorial I ever had in any game I ever played I think I can't pay attention, but he's not doing anything. And I guess he's gonna go up. Oh, it wants me to fill up the circle or something? Oh, yeah, it does. Good flying! Now, some of it wasn't exactly by the book. So, toss the damn book and live a little. Where's he going now? Leave him. See those That's all I needed balloons? to do? Weapons God check. damn. Fire at will. I can do that. Mm, this one seems closer. Yeah, this is one heck of a kite. There are still more balloons. Moving this thing is so sensitive. Roger that. This one. The only one left. It's the one that I just passed by. So I didn't know I had to like make it go inside the circle. And so I wasted a lot of time with that. And I was thinking like I should speed run this whole thing, but the end. Yeah, I see them. Try using the rockets on them. Get a feel for hitting the ground targets. rockets were invented during this era? I don't think so. Because I know rockets, they would end up burning the whole damn plane down, wouldn't it? This is weird. I gotta search this up. This 
this can't be real. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is not part of the era. These kinds of rockets cannot be attached on these kinds of planes. But whatever. Whatever he wants to do with this. Oh, my head is gonna, oh my god! What the fuck is wrong with him? I was about to crash into him. I was about to crash into him. Oh shit. What do you think? We shoot him down. Alright, we're gonna be going into our first battle. Ooh, I think one of them crashed into me. Oh my god, they actually shot me. I got this guy. This one, gotta get this one. Oh my god. Well, it's four against two, so. I can't get no one. I'm pretty sure somebody's gonna have motion sickness on this. One wing broken. I got this, I got this. Oh my god, we're going upside down! Oh, wrong one. Oh, no, I can't go this way. <laughs> I was about to go straight to the ground. I got you. Rocket! Boom! Get the hell down! Still got one more in our tail, I think. I said in my partner's tail. What the hell is he? I'm pretty sure there was not rockets on planes in World War One. Highly doubt there was any rockets, but whatever. Jesus, I suck at this thing. Oh, but when it comes to multiplayer, I can freaking do this. I can nothing. It's because this thing is too sensitive. I can't get it. Where is it? That was too close for comfort. There we you go. can say that again. Oh, what the fuck? The Giving her the gun might have thrown something off. Repair what you can from up front. Yeah, I was about to do that right now. Oh come on, that repair is super quick compared to multiplayer. Oh, Where to now? I see him. Hang on to your knickers. What'd you call him? Oh, come on. Bloody hell. Oh my god, I need to reload. Friendly hit. He's going down. We ain't gonna slow anything down here. I totally missed that one. I can only imagine how battlefront will be. No, this one. Damn it. Oh, no, 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 no. Jesus. They're literally crashing to me on that part. And we're gonna dip. <laughs> I freaking tricked them, except for one, I think. Here we go. Is that one of them? What is it? Fire. Nice. Oh, God damn. 
Son of a bitch! They say we're playing Destruction Derby as a freaking plane. Where do you think he's going? That way. And we're going after him. Yeah, if we wait for an ambush? I don't think so, son. This is not a good sign. We just played Destruction Derby as a freaking plane. What are you it's doing? crazy. We should turn back! Ah, to hell with base! <laughs> yeah, because your, your general is freaking tied up to a chair. Accidentally discovered where Germans were keeping their munitions for half the Western <laughs> Front. And Wilson's pictures would help HQ launch a major assault. There was just one problem. I'm not sure about this. Oh, come on. We did a great thing. We'll get medals for this. We weren't even supposed to be there. When the commander sees these pictures, he won't care. We did a great thing. We can do it. Didn't again. you tie him to a chairman? I'll make you a deal. If we pile up on this, then you need to promise me. That you'll get me back in one piece. Sure thing. Promise. I need your word. Okay, I promise. Come on, stop doing with this twinkle shit and give them that Stay letter here. already. And don't cause any trouble. You know, I did like the guy. But he was kind of naive. Sir, you might want to take a look at these. Saints alive, your man must be one, one hell of a pilot. Before we knew it, we were back in the air. Our mission? To clear the way for the bombers so they could blow that fortress all to hell. First, we'd have to down the barrage blimps. Jesus, imagine being a lookout on a blimp. Bad luck, Fritz. Next. We'd have to deal but with why did they have to protect trucks. the blimps, though? The assault was already in full swing when we got there. We'd have to deal with all those defenses, then escort our bombers Damn, to their target crazy. when they arrived. Tall order. But victory here could change the course of the whole damn war, they said. 